It is time to talk to Koi Love. It's our Zayo connection. Koi, thanks so much for joining us. Congratulations on the big W. Thank you. First of all, what did you have at training table, and are you going to continue to eat that meal the rest of the season? <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. No, just coming out here doing my job, playing hard, whatever my team needs me to do, I'm absolutely down to do it. So good dub, good sweep this weekend. Cool. you know when you, the decision to transfer and things go the way they go, you're at Oregon State, you don't even get in that ball game, and how you've been able to emerge over the last couple of weeks, really getting into the system, what changed for you over the course of the last couple of weeks? Um, honestly, just adjusting. Uh, I know that at the end of the day, hard work pays off. So I just stayed in the gym, stayed in my next to my coaches, understanding the game plans, understanding what it is they wanted to do every single every single game, being close to my teammates. So yeah, I believe in myself and they do too. So here we are. You know, yesterday we were watching uh, Salvo, your assistant, like working that head and shoulder fake, and you used it about three times very effectively today. Talk about just they're daring you to shoot, and you go, all right, you want it, I'm going to give it. Hey, I got to expand my game. So if they're going to let me shoot it, I'm going to keep getting in the gym, and I'm going to keep knocking them down. Uh, your three-point shooting markedly improved as well. I see you after practice working on extra shots. What have you worked on specifically to come back away from the basket and be confident from long range? No, yeah, just being more confident in my three ball. I know I can shoot it. I know I can make shots. So it's all about uh, putting up reps and being able to make them in the game. What is it about this Arizona defense, Coy, that is different from any other team you've ever played on? Hey, we're, we get after it. Um, <laughs> Adia stresses it, Salvo stresses it, it's the backbone of everything that we do, so, hey. You know, we've talked a lot about this weekend here in Tucson, the men's team, two big wins, you guys two big wins, the, the crowds for all four games, amazing. What's it like to just be part of this program and, and part of what is going on here? No, yeah, this place is special. The, it's 12 o'clock on a Sunday and, and people came out and packed this place out. We love our fans, we love our supporters, and we're gonna keep playing hard for them. They, they help us win a lot of games. Well, up next for you, your first experience with the Territorial Cup, the home at home against the rival up north, Arizona State. What have your teammates told you about that? Hey, we know it's going to be physical. It's going to be a battle from first quarter to fourth quarter, so I'm excited. You know, Coy, for so, much, so many players now in college basketball, men and women, it, the transfer portal is a, a big deal, and you made the decision to, to leave Vandy and come here. What attracted you to Arizona and what's that transition like? Just sort of big picture. Honestly, winning. I want to go to the Final Four. I want to win a national championship. I don't have to be around in a program that does that. So here I am. All right, Coy. Well, Arizona's made eight trips to the NCAA tournament, of course, last year in the title game. And the way you guys are rolling, I think we might be able to pencil in number nine. Hey, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Right on. <laughs> good luck and good health the rest of the way. Thanks so much for joining us here with this conversation. Mary, what a game.